on a family walk. Hey, Lil. Lily is in his wagon. There's Biscuit and Lily. And Jimmy. Having fun, Bear? Huh, Bentley? Are you having fun? You want to get out, don't you? Hey everybody, it is Monday and I'm with Jimmy Ho. Say hi Jimmy. He's driving. Um, we are going to see Beauty and the Beast and I'm so excited. Um, especially since we didn't get to go on Friday, I was really sad even though I knew it was for the best. But we are heading to the movie now and I'm super excited and I'm feeling like 95% better and it's beautiful outside. so. It's been a good Monday. Uh, yeah, so we're doing that. And then we might grab dinner afterward, depending on um, what we have at the movie. And then I'm gonna run by my office, and then who knows. Um, so yeah, I will check back in with you guys later. So we just got out of Beauty and the Beast, and it was everything that I wanted it to be and more. Um, you know exactly what's gonna happen, but still, sometimes you're like, ooh, at other times. Um, like in the ballroom scene where they're dancing and I totally teared up. Did everyone tear up? Because I did. Oh, and the Be Our Guest scene was so, so good. And at the very end of the song, our waiter brought us popcorn, so I kind of felt like I was part of it. Is that weird? It was the best, and I wanna see it again. So, um, if you liked Beauty and the Beast, then you should definitely go see it. It's a lot of fun. Hey guys, it is Tuesday. Uh, it is in the afternoon and um, late afternoon, almost evening. Um, it is a beautiful day. It's hot. It's like 84 degrees or something. It's hot. Um, I'm about to go meet up with Jimmy and we're going to a couple of media tastings tonight and I will take you guys along. Jimmy. Say hi, Jimmy. Hello. Um, we just left the first media tasting at Guero's and we had margaritas and chips and queso and salsa. And you see this like sun on me. It's still bright outside. Um, and tacos. And now we're going to another media tasting at a place called, what's it called? Bon Homie. Bon Homie. I don't, I don't know. That's phonetically, you know, how you would pronounce it. But um, Jimmy says it's like a French bistro. I don't know, but I will take pictures and take you guys along.
it's Wednesday and um, it's uh, afternoon and finished with work I'm going to get my hair done um, I just got it done like four weeks ago but it's already like kind of long well longish um, and I am stopping by Sonic to get a drink I usually take my hair girl a drink um, cuz I mean she's working hard well, she's thirsty I don't know I like to do it so I do it um, most of the time and yeah so that's what I'm doing and I will show you guys what it looks like afterward so I'm back from getting my hair done and um, I just got it trimmed and then we brought up a little bit of the blonde just to blend it a little bit more and lighten up the ends um, somewhat but it's fun and it's you know cute I love it I love Courtney she always makes my hair look super cute um, so I did that and while I was there I decided to get um, a gel manicure um, summer works in the salon and you guys look at my nails are you ready for this can you see that it's not gonna focus Anyway, kind of. It's a cat. You see the cactus or the cacti? Multiple cactus, cacti. Um, I am obsessed with it. She is so talented when it comes to nail art. Um, I was pretty open. I didn't really have any ideas in mind. And she was like, How about cactus? And I was like, Yes, I love cactus. Um, and so it's perfect. I think next time we have an idea in mind um, that's along the cactus theme. So these are so cute and I am obsessed with them. Uh, I was going to try a new instant pot recipe tonight, but I was there for a little bit longer. So I did not get um, a chance to do that uh, for tonight, but that's what I'm doing tomorrow. So I uh, hope you guys are having a good week. I will vlog the Instapot stuff tomorrow. So I have everything ready now for my recipe. I've got some garlic, ginger, onion, chicken. I've got my spice mixture here, which I've already placed on the chicken. And the spice mixture is these things right here, garam masala, salt, crushed red pepper, coriander, um, cumin, did I call that? <laughs> garam masala, cum cumin, um, turmeric. And yeah, that's it. So I mixed all those together. I used half of it on the chicken and I'm also using coconut cream, coconut milk, tomato paste, um, crushed tomatoes and some lime juice. Now this recipe is in a book that I have fed and fit which is a mostly like paleo recipe book um, and it calls for like pre-cooking the chicken sauteing it and then sauteing the veggies with the rice mixture but I am going to try this in the instant pot. Anyway after you do those things you're supposed to cook it in the slow cooker for four to eight hours on high or low depending on how long you have but I'm going to attempt to do everything in the instant pot and I'm not pre-cooking the chicken so this could be a total disaster or this could be an amazing dinner that's ready in 15 minutes now prep time I mean takes a while if you're slow at chopping things but it could be worth it if you turn an eight-hour recipe into a half hour 45 minutes so I will keep you guys posted all right, I am sauteing the onions, garlic, ginger, and the spices in butter in the Instant Pot. And I'm just gonna do that until the onions get soft and then I'll add the other item. Okay, so I have put in everything now. Um, everything is in the pot, the chicken is not cooked. It's just in the sauce, uh, but the sauce looks like a good color and it's nice and thick. And I think when we cook it, it'll get even thicker. 
So, um, I cooked it all in this pot. I sauteed the vegetables like I showed you. Then I added all of the additional ingredients and then threw in the raw chicken without sauteing it. So, um, I am going to go ahead and I'm gonna put the lid on and then I'm going to press the poultry button and let it cook and then let it do a quick release. So this is probably gonna take about 30 minutes, probably. I'll keep you guys posted. Okay, so it is done. It took about uh, 45 minutes for it to get up to temperature, cook for a couple minutes, and then release naturally. Um, so this is what it looks like. It looks pretty good. It smells really good. The chicken is cooked all the way we tempted and it was actually a little bit overcooked. So, you know, so far so good. We're gonna plate it up and then taste it. So we just finished dinner and I didn't have to leave the house today. So getting real with you and showing you my face with no makeup, so sorry. Um, this is just what I look like. Oh, Aww. So we finished dinner and it was really good. What do you think, Jimmy? It was really good. Yeah, what do you give it? Eight and a half out of 10. He said he gives it an eight and a half because he prefers dark meat and we use chicken breast. Sure. Um, we, the recipe called for three pounds of chicken breast, and that seemed like a lot, and I was worried it wouldn't be saucy enough, but it was plenty saucy, and we have enough for like another dinner, and Jimmy ate quite a few helpings, didn't you? No. How many? Two. And? Well, I mean, those two other small ones doesn't count. See my cactus? I'm still obsessed with them. Um, it was really good. It is definitely the best, my favorite tikka that we've made at home. And cooking it in the Instant Pot was awesome. I liked that we didn't have to use another pan um, to saute the things. I just did it right in the pan. Now, when we eat the leftovers and have to clean the pan, we will see like if, uh, if it's stuck to the pan and if it's a mess. But we liked it. We give it how many thumbs up, Jimmy? And I give it two as well, but I'm holding my phone, so. So it gets three and my one over there. Um, yeah, so that's it. It is Thursday night. I'm going to upload this video. It'll probably be up a little bit late. Tomorrow's Friday. It's supposed to be stormy. Jimmy has kickball tomorrow night, but I'm not sure if it'll get canceled. So we'll see. We'll keep you guys posted when I update um, over the weekend. Hope you guys have a good weekend. Let me know what you're doing below. Please subscribe, leave me a thumbs up and a comment. Have a good weekend. Bye guys.